where major cell phone carriers are boasting higher speeds thanks in part to the new 5G rollout, but they're also set to phase out 3G networks this year, meaning many older cell phones will become obsolete. CNN's Isabel Rosales reports on the gadgets that might soon no longer work from your home security system to your cars, even medical devices. A 20 year era is coming to an end. The 3G shutdown is a natural evolution in the technology world. 3G is making way for the much faster 5G network. The tech experts like Tom Camber with the AARP are sharing an urgent warning. The level of gravity is, is very high for us. He says many Americans are not prepared for the wave of 3G devices that will soon lose connectivity. Older cell phones, some car navigation and emergency services, home security systems, and even some medical devices like emergency alert pendants might be useless without taking action. Camber says one group is especially vulnerable. Older Americans are most at risk from this transition because, first of all, they're the group that tends to hold on to devices a little bit longer. And I think it happened because Tino Perez says he has seen firsthand the reluctance to upgrade. They're more afraid to the technology, especially older people. He warns those customers could be left in the dark without access to Wi-Fi at home, no more texts or calls. Obviously, if they're using this type of phones, they're going to be out completely. Even to 911. I don't think this is on a lot of people's radar, to be honest with you. Colonel James Manny, head of state police in Rhode Island, is working to get the message out. Well, very simply, it's very serious. If you do not upgrade your 3G phone, you'll be unable to connect to 911. Camber says, don't panic. It's a golden opportunity for some digital hygiene. The first thing we want them to think about is just, this is a moment to take an hour and just do a check through of what kind of connectivity you have in your house that is mobile based. If you have a 3G device, consider upgrading now or contact your providers for details on next steps. An upgrade doesn't have to break the bank. Cell phones can run under $200. Don't get upsold on something that's not what you need. I'm Isabel Rosales reporting.